Welcome to a video from TheDigitalLifestyle.com In this video I'm going to show you how you can set your Christmas lights like these ones I've got on my desk in this picture here uh, how you can set them up so they automatically come on when it goes dark you don't have to tell um, the system what time it goes dark it automatically knows so if it was on in the summer or the winter it would adjust it accordingly and uh, in fact it updates it every day so I'm going to show you how you can do that using uh, I'm going to be using the D-Link smart plug that you can see here in this picture there are other smart plugs available from Samsung, Wemo, Hive and other services and uh, D-Link's the one I'm going to be using and we're going to use IFTTT for this which is the um, if this than that service, which uh, a web service. So the first thing you need to do is have an account for this. Um, so make sure to so go to the, the website, and create an account, or sign into your existing account. The next thing you're going to do is link the service that uh, your smart plug service to IFTTT. So you can go to search and uh, mine at D-Link. So I search for D-Link. If I search for D-Link, you'll see D-Link smart plug you can then link that to your D-Link account. So when you use the D-Link smart plugs, uh, you set them up on your, your phone or your tablet, you, you put an account in, and that's the account that you then link in with this. So I am uh, linked that already. The other service you're going to need to use is uh, for the location and the, no, and the uh, daylight time is weather unlimited. There probably are others you can use, but I use that it one. Also, uh, you can input your location and when it knows the location, it will know uh, the time the daylight ends. So these are all the different things. And as you can see, there's a, to automatically turn your lights on at sunset. So this is one that I'm going to use. But I'm going to create it from scratch. So I go and do a new applet. And if this and that. So if this, and this is end of daylight time. So I can do weather unlimited. Uh, weather underground, sorry. Um, and I want it to do when it's sunset. Then, this is where I link it now with uh, a D Link smart plug. I want to turn the plug on. It lasts me which of my plugs? I've got a few plugs. So I'm going to put it with tree lights. Create action. And that's it. So if it's sunset, it turns the tree lights on. It's that simple. All I do is finish that, and it's done. So that will automatically turn my lights on when it gets to sunset. Now, I want to turn them off again as well, don't I? So for that, I create a new applet. If this, and that will use the date and time. I'm going to say every day at, let's say, 11 p.m., then... Get the D-Link again. Turn off tree lights. So every day, 11 p.m., turns the tree lights off. So it's really that simple. Those two applets, one turns it on when it's the sunset, end of day, and uh, end of daylight, and the other one turns them back off again. You can control, um, if you've got multiple smart plugs, then you will need to create a flow for each smart plug. So if I wanted one for the garden lights and tree lights, I'd create one for that and one for that and so on. And um, that's it. Job done. Dead simple. And uh, I've also got a video on how you can use Alexa to turn these on and off as well. So head over to DigitalLifestyle.com or look on our YouTube channel for more details. Thanks for watching this video.